All right, everybody, welcome to another episode of Catching California. Now, I am not in California, but I am back in Connecticut, where I'm from, and we are doing a little creek fishing mission. We are on the beautiful, quiet Hockenham River, which uh, I grew up starting to fish at least over 10 years ago here, and uh, it's got some small, small largemouth, it's got some smallmouth, it's got creek chub, it's got other kind of sucker fish, it's got some, uh, and it's got some trout, some brook trout, and maybe some rainbow, but I think it's mainly brook trout. So we will see what we can get on the old fly rod because it is a uh, wild trout management area, so you can only catch and release trout and only use uh, single barbless hooks. So um, perfect for a fly setup, and we'll see if we can get some trout and maybe some uh, smallmouth and largemouth. And if all else fails, there's always our good friends, the skunk beating bluegill. So uh, stay tuned, and we'll see what we can get on the good old Hockenham. Hey, 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 all right. Hey, that is the first fish of my return trip to the Hawken River. Haven't been here in ages. Probably haven't fished here in over a decade, so. A little mouth ears. Get in there. Skunk is off. Skunk is off. I know there are more bluegill, there are um, chub, creek chub in here, and there are um, smallmouth. I've seen some largemouth now, and trout. Okay, I don't know why I'm doing this. No. really wish I had brought my waders. I had my waders in the car and I decided not to wear them. I don't know why. That's way too slippery. I think we're just gonna say screw it. <laughs> well, now we're really gonna say screw it. Oh, oh, 
that's super soft mud. Oh, 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 oh. Woo. Look at that. That's just, that's great. All right, I guess, um, I guess now that I got falling in the river out of the way, um, I guess I had better boots when I used to come here. And there's not even a fish in sight because they've heard every little footstep I've made. Oh, that was to the knee. Oh, that's to the knee. Oh, oh, oh. That is nasty. Oh. Ooh. Everybody just take a look at that. Ooh. Oh, I see some fish. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's trout right there. That looks like brook trout. something I got something I got something oh, oh, oh. oh yeah what I get what I get what I get here we go creek chub there we go beautiful my first creek chub I sounded like a little kid right there look at this bad boy look at that creek chub am I getting this on video here Little creek chub, perfect. Going back in there. Wow! <laughs> All right. That's two fish so far. I'm pretty happy about that. All right, guys. I didn't have the actual hook set on camera, but we have ourselves a very good sized bluegill. Look at that bad boy. That's a that's a healthy fish right there. Let's get a picture for the give me your give me your lip. I oh, have a tiny one. Beautiful gill on the fly. Scared away all the trout, of course. So that's three fish on the fly. That one and a nibble that I missed on the other one before was on a little Copper John type, type fly on the, I don't know. I am not the most knowledgeable of all these different flies. <laughs> Sorry guys, once again, camera malfunction, camera turned off. Let me get out in the light here. Got ourselves a new species, a little rock bass. Look at that. Back in the water. Woo!
There we go. There we go. Yes. 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 That's a trout. That's got to be a trout. That's a trout. Yes. Or a creek chub. That's a creek chub. That's a great little creek chub. Yes. Oh, camera was on, thank God. That's a good size one. Oh, you swallowed that. I don't have any. All right, we're gonna have to do some. Apparently I forgot my stuff at home or at, at the house. Oh, there we go. There we go. I think we got another bluegill on hand. Yup. Another pocket on bluegill. Hey. Another hawking on bluegill after that good sized creek chub that I think I was able to save. He looked like he started to swim off, but he was struggling a little. So the creek mission at Hakana River in Connecticut was a success, part one that is. As you can see, we had a couple of chub, one decent sized one, and we had some bluegill and a rock bass, which was a first for me out of this river. So I was pretty happy with the fishing, you know, I had a couple of strikes on some dry flies, but nothing, nothing that really got on the hook. So, you know, I'm feeling like I got a pattern going for these fish and I'm gonna be back out here uh, soon. Now I'm hoping to also get out on the Connecticut River and do some kayak fishing like I've done in the past. So stay tuned for that also. And uh, be sure to get out there, get yourself some tight lines, you know, hit that like and subscribe button and take care.